Hey guys, thanks for tuning in. I'm Tyler Mount, and you're tuned in to the Tyler Mount vlog. You are not dreaming. It is the one, the only Broadway legend, Krista Rodriguez. Welcome to the Tyler Mount vlog. Thank you. I'm so excited to have you here. I'm so excited to be here. This has been a long time coming. Yes. And I am so excited that you're finally sitting on the couch. This yellow couch. There are 12 year olds around America who are dying <laughs> that you're here, um, but not as much as I'm dying. Um, <laughs> Because in case you've been hiding under a rock, Miss um, Rodriguez has done a few Broadway shows, to say to say the least. Mm -hmm. um, Spring Awakening, first take Adam's Family, In the Heights, Spring Awakening, again, A Chorus Line and Good Vibrations. Yes. Right, and Smash. And Smash, which Hello. is basically a Hello. bigger musical. Hello. Yeah. Um, so you have seen your fair share of Broadway shows. True. You have done a few Broadway shows. Yes. And you have starred in NBC's most beloved television musical. Most beloved. beloved. Most beloved. That's um, a direct quote from Tyler. Um, tell me about uh -huh. some of, because I don't know if you can randomly choose one, but what was your favorite role slash what are some of your favorite roles that you've been able to play? Um, Ilsa was always my favorite role from Spring Awakening. When I understudied it, it was my favorite. And from going on, people would always ask me, and I'd be like, you know, I love playing all these other roles, but Ilsa was my jam. She was my homegirl. Mm -hmm. And um, and then I got to play it. Right. And like, you know, a long time later, like nine years later, it'd be like coming up to you and being like, you can play Oliver. Like right. you're gonna be able to play Oliver now. You know, like, I'm ready. you're like, like what? Yeah. That ship had sailed and my dream role came back around. You have had an iconic Broadway career so far, much less what you will continue to do. Two that, knock on wood. That's knock not on wood. That's not, it's that's fake not brick. Even that's Damn it, Krista. <laughs> No, you can knock on my head magic, or like, magic. there's some like probably wood down here or something. Yes. You know, like we can, yeah, okay. my shoes have wood. There you go. Yeah. Tell me, for to this moment, what was the most iconic moment of your career so far? This might be one of them. I don't know if it is the one, mm -hmm. but performing with Spring Waking number one at the Tonys uh -huh. was one of the most extraordinary experiences. And we were all there together. We were all brand new. We were babies. And I remember we had just won and we came out on stage and we were just freaking out. And the broadcast had ended, and Jonathan Groff came up behind me and he said, he held my hand, and he said, look out here because we may never see this view again. And the two of us, little Jay Groff and I, at like 20 years old, stared out into Radio City and like had a moment. So it is time for my favorite segment. We tweeted the Twitterazzi. Mm -hmm. We let them know that you were coming to the show. Okay. Um, and we selected a fangirl of the week. Of the week. Of the week. Okay. A fangirl of the week. Okay. Who Today's fangirl of the week is Phoenix at Phoenix Killjoy. Okay. Okay. She has a few questions for you that are very, very a important. A few questions. Yes. Okay. okay. What is your favorite song to sing, period? I'm actually really curious. That's why I chose this one. I think Blue Wind might be one of my favorite songs okay. to sing. Okay. What is your favorite quote of all time? Hmm. Mm. I mean, I have a, I have a, um, a uh, poster in my house that says Carpe That Effing Diem. I, like I that. love that. <laughs> that was Fangirl of the Week. Thanks, Phoenix. Thanks, Fangirl. Um, Phoenix. Fangirl Phoenix. Thanks. Fangirl Phoenix. Th thank you so much. Now it is time for the infamous Lightning Round. Lightning Round. Lightning, round. lightning, round. lightning Thunder, 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 thunder Lightning, lightning. Of water. Yeah, Let's get ready. it's scary in here, I'm telling you. Mm -hmm. Okay. Three, two, one. What is the number one thing on your bucket list this year? I'm going to Antarctica. Oh, whoa, okay. What's your <laughs> ideal weekend? Um, going to the movies, walking around the park, and eating good food. Okay, what makes you feel most alive? Um, traveling. Best day of your life? Oh, when I went to Disney World with Jeremy Jordan and Andy Manton. Oh, shut up, okay. Are you an introvert or an extrovert? Uh, in between. Okay, what is your philosophy on life? Um, to keep going. Okay, what do you think you'll be doing in 10 years? Oh gosh, um, I hope I'm um, doing work that I love. Okay, first playbill you ever received. Um, uh, Fiddler on the Roof, I saw the May uh, revival in 1990. Okay, um, recreate your playbill headshot to camera. <sighs> Time, done. <laughs> okay. Killed it! Well, if you liked what you saw, and God knows you did, like this on Facebook, share it with a friend, but most importantly, what, Krista? Don't forget to subscribe right on down there and if you want more krista rodriguez because i don't know who wouldn't you can follow her on twitter at krista rodriguez but the o in rodriguez is a zero it's ever <laughs> someone had my name before we started i love it okay and as always be sure to follow my broadway journey all year long on instagram snapchat facebook and twitter at tyler gmail but most importantly at playable.com slash tyler until next time i'm tyler and i'm krista reminding you to give, give love. love wow <laughs>